in the nucleoplasm of a cell, the transcription produces an mRNA protein complexes or mRNPS. Then with this mRNPS, the heterodimeric TAP-NXT1 complex binds. TAP is otherwise called as NXF1. The TAP-NXT1 complex acts like a karyopherin. It is called as karyopherin because both TAP and NXT1 interacts with the FG domains of the FG nucleophorin. This interaction allows the TAP and NXT1 to diffuse through the central channel of NPC or nuclear pore complex. An RNA helicase called as DBP5 also binds to the mRNPS. The DBP5 also acts as mRNA export protein. The TAP NXT1 and other mRNP exporters bound along the length of mRNP assist its export through NPC. As the mRNP complex is transported through an NPC, the DBP5 and other mRNP exporters dissociate from the mRNP before it reaches the cytoplasmic side of the NPC. The DBP5 associates with the cytoplasmic filaments of the NPC. The DBP5 then binds with the cytoplasmic ATP. The DBP5 then catalyzes a biochemical reaction in which the bound ATP is hydrolyzed to ADP and PI. The ADP and PI are then dissociated from the DBP5. This DBP5 then helps to dissociate the bound TAP and NXT1 from the mRNP. The TAP and NXT1 proteins are recycled back into the nucleus by RAN-dependent import process. As the mRNP complex is transported through the NPC, the proteins associated with it are exchanged for another set of proteins in the cytoplasm, a process called mRNP remodeling. The small subunit of a ribosome first associate with the mRNA. The large subunit of ribosome then unites with the small subunit and completes the formation of a functional ribosome on the mRNA. This functional ribosome starts the translation. Like this, other small and large subunits of ribosome unite on the mRNA and start the translation. Please like, subscribe and share.